with the Lottie Icon Box widget add-on for Elementor, both Elementor Free and Pro, you can really bring animation to life for your graphics on your site at very little cost to speed. This is a great way to add movement to your site. For more on the Element Pack add-ons for Elementor by BD Themes, check out the link in the description below. But first, let's see what the Lottie Icon Box is all about. If you don't know what Lottie is all about, it's basically a very small file format that allows graphics to move. And you go and download the link to this graphics and then you can display it on your site. But there's far more to it than just the graphic. You have control over colors, over speed and the animation, autoplay and all those settings. Let's go into our site where we have our Elementor page open and I'm using a free version here of Elementor. And what we're going to do is bring in the icon box, the Lottie icon box from Element Pack. And all I do is in search widget, I'm going to look for Lottie, L-O-T-T-I-E. And you will see these two widgets from Element Pack appear because there are two versions. The one is just the image and the other one we are working with here is the Lottie icon box. I'll click and drag it onto the page and let's say these icons with their buttons all of that I'm going to replace with one icon box. Drop it and you will see what I mean, replace it with one icon box. Over here is the Lottie image and the graphic for that. If you don't know where to get it, simply click here on look here. And this is going to take you to LottieFiles.com where you have access to a bunch of free Lottie animations as well as a marketplace down here if you want to go buy ones. And not a bad price. You'll see they actually come at a very decent price. Let's see if we can find something for Twitter. If I type in the Twitter, or that Twitter logo. And in fact, I find quite a few. So let's see this one over here. And then I'll go ahead and copy the URL down here where it says Lottie Animation URL. Go back to Elementor. And up here where it says Select JSON Source, I'm going to select load from URL. Select everything there, paste your new URL, and look at that, how quickly we had brought that in. You can also do that with uploading a JSON file. So if I go back, let's choose another one. Let's choose this one over here with the message. Up here, you will see it says download JSON. Click here on Lottie JSON. Let's go back to Elementor, and then we open the file that has downloaded. Select the code, copy it, control C, command C. And then here where it says select JSON source, you're going to select custom JSON code. Click in the box and paste your code and you will see how quickly it updates to that graphic that you had brought in. You have a few other options here like how to play it, how to loop it, the speed, and when it starts on page load or on page scroll. And then for the rest of the icon box, you have full control over the headings, the descriptions, and the button for call to action at the bottom. To learn more about all the goodies in the Element Pack for Elementor by BD Themes, make sure you subscribe here to our YouTube channel at Websites for Beginners. Stay safe. See you in the next video. This is JP signing off.